So right in the middle of the computer science building is a huge ramp that takes you from the third floor to the fifth floor. Usually it's a pretty inefficient mode of transportation, but sometimes if you're lucky, you can spot a robot or two handing out candies and making their way down the helix. It's actually pretty cool. The roof of the helix is inspired from mathematician John Conway's Game of Life. So you see really intricate, really cool patterns up there. On the fifth floor of the gate center, as you can see in this background, is the Pausch Bridge. It connects the CS building to the School of Drama. It's a concrete metaphor, get it, of the CMU's focus on interdisciplinary studies. In fact, a couple of years ago, a couple of CS faculty at CMU won the Academy Award for the work they did on the facial remapping techniques for the Star Wars franchise. There's also the BCSA program, which stands for Bachelor of Computer Science and Arts, and the ID8 program, which stands for Integrated Design, Technology, and Arts, that you can take classes in. There are also plenty of clubs that are not CS related, and a lot of CS students are in those clubs, so there's a huge diversity of things you can learn at CMU. Another thing you see in the background here is the Citadel Teaching Commons. It's actually one of the many uh, collaborative learning spaces in this building. Usually in the afternoons, all the CS majors and the AI majors and the comp bio majors come and sit in these collaborative learning areas with their friends and brainstorm and work on challenging fun homework problems together. They'll just take out a whiteboard marker and start writing on the whiteboards that are really common in this building. Actually, sometimes a professor would walk past and look at students working on a homework assignment for their class and pass on a cheeky smile. It's actually pretty cool. Another thing on this floor are all the computer clusters. This is where all the labs for all of the introductory computer science classes are held, and they're equipped with pretty much the latest in technology you would ask for.